Today I'm going to teach you about Model S User Form. Model S User Form allow users to continue to work in the application while the another form is still displayed. That means you can work on multiple user forms simultaneously, this one-liner code will change the user experience. You can also do this without writing any code. Simply open user form and change the show model property to false. Let's do the demonstration. There are three buttons available here. Model S user form 1, Model S user form 2, and Model user. I will call my Model S form. Now I can also call my another user form. You can call multiple user forms at a time and operate all of them together. As you can see, I'm able to type on my user form when the another form is displayed. I'm also able to operate my Excel file, you will be free to work on anything. Now let's demonstrate on model user form. I've again called my same form but it's not model less. As you can see, I'm not able to call my another form. I'm not able to click anywhere on the Excel file. You can use model user form when you don't want user to operate anything, when the user form is called. Hope you understand the uses of model and model less user form. Now let's go to the Visual Basic Editor. I've created three subroutines to call three user forms. It's very simple, and one-liner code as mentioned earlier. You just have to create module and write this code to call model less user form. Make sure to write false. Writing false will call the user form as model less. However, if you don't write false, it will call model user form by default. Comment me if you have any query.